Welcome everyone to this video on the pricing update in Quantify. Quantify uses three levels of pricing. The first of which is the Quantify pricing, which is list pricing brought in by our system once a month. The second level is using the pricing update service, which this video will go through. And the third level is the takeoff pricing that you would get in the summary screen that you would send out to your supplier or multiple suppliers for job specific pricing. The pricing update service is found in the database. On the left hand side, towards the bottom, you will see price update. In here, we can add a supplier profile and you can add as many different suppliers as you'd like. And what this is going to do is it's going to send out a list of items you typically use. This is not job specific pricing, but this is for items you typically would use that you want the supplier to give you your discounted price to upload that price into the system for you. So for the purposes of this video, let's put in a supplier of City Electric Supply and we'll type CES. Once that's there, I can click on them and I can add in their name. I can put in my contact name. I can put in a phone number and I can put in an email address. Now your account number is what you would want to put in here with that is your account with that supplier. Once you have this information in here on the right hand side is where you're going to go and look through the items database for all the different types of items that you would typically use that you want price on. So if I go in here and select a few things and you can get as, as granular as you want, right down to the specific items, you can say, I want to select everything in these folders. Uh, and what this will do, once I hit save profile, I can download this Excel. When I open this Excel file, this is what you're going to send out the first time to the supplier. So everything we have selected from that list is going to be in this Excel file as items. And the supplier is going to go through on this row and they're just going to enter in their price, whatever that might be. And when they send it back to you after you've taken this Excel sheet and emailed it to them the first time, when you get it back, you're going to drag and drop it into this area here. And what this is going to do is this is going to update or upload all of the pricing for all of the items that you've sent out into this CES supplier. Once you've done this the first time, then you can schedule it. If, if you want the system to send this uh, Excel file out every two weeks, once a month, every two months or once a year, the system will then send out this Excel file to this email address. It will copy you so you know that it has been sent out. And then once you receive it back, you can check it, of course, to make sure everything makes sense in it and then upload it into here by dragging and dropping it and the system will have all the updated pricing. To use this pricing, back on the estimate management screen, if we select any kind of an estimate under the pricing drop down box, we can see there is now CES. So if I click to use this, then all the pricing that's going to come in the summary screen and in your closeout is going to be from your CES profile. During your takeoff or any time during the job, you can always switch around to different profiles, uh, whatever you have in here, that's not an issue. That's it for this video on the pricing update. If you have any questions, feel free to always click the question mark in the top right hand corner and send us an email or email us at info at Thank you.